Hey YouTube, this is Dave from My Tech Man Cave, and today I'm going to show you how to get install us 5 onto um, an iPod Touch. Uh, it's running 5.1.1, and install us 5 is also updated. There's also been some changes to iFile, so you might want to go first things first. Go into Cydia on your jailbroken iPod Touch, and uh, it wait for it to refresh, then hit Changes and make sure you install any changes, respring or whatever you have to do. And then when you go back into uh, Cydia, you have to install a package. For those who don't have Haculus, um, the, the source is uh, Cydia.haculo, H-A-C-K-U-L-O dot U-S forward slash. And I'll put it in the description. And then once you add this uh, source or this repo, uh, you'll be able to, you know, install install us five. Now, people have been getting error messages, uh, mismatch error message uh, when they try to install install us five. But there's a way around that. You have to uh, download Safari, uh, download enabler. All right. So f the other thing is, if you already have uh, um, install us four, you can continue to use that. But if you want all the new features and install us five with the um, BitTorrent and uh, also having uh, notifications on any updates that you get for uh, any of the apps that you've downloaded to test, uh, try out before you buy. Anyway, uh, so the next thing you're going to need is you're going to need iFile. So you want to install that I F I L E, and I recommend you paying for it so that we support developers. And uh, but today I'm just going to do it like this. I'm going to install it through, and it'll install a bunch of things. So now you're, I'm getting iFile. I updated my Cydia, and I also um, put the source for Haculus in here. And then um, I'm going to install another uh, another app or tweak, uh, and it's called Safari. Uh, download enabler okay and then this way you could download it from the internet the install is five uh, deb uh, file and that this way you won't get any errors so anyway uh, I installed I file and now to get the Safari um, I'm gonna go into search and we're gonna type in uh, download What you're going to get is you're going to get this tweet. Of course, I spelled download wrong. Okay, download enabler. And what's going to pop up is Safari download enabler. All right, so you're going to get that for free on the. Uh, get that for free so that downloads and that's just something that gets added uh, it's an add-on to Safari so that you can download these packages okay all right so then we're gonna respring so what have I done so far I've added Haculus to Cydia I um, put the hack put the um, I file on put Safari download enabler I got rid of install us four completely uh, uh, removed it through Cydia because you know you put a fresh install of this <clears throat> excuse me so the next thing you're gonna do is you're gonna go uh, I'm gonna give you a link uh, uh, to a, a file that you can download from the internet and this is the actual link here that I emailed to my daughter's phone and then what will happen is you'll install this deb file and what's going to happen is you're going to be brought to uh, this site the media fire site and you just hit the download button there no need to put captures and I see here it's loading it's actually using Safari download enabler so there it is and then 
you need that iFile because you want to open it in iFile right up here. See? That's why you need iFile installed. And then it's going to show you the actual download. And then you're going to write, you're going to click on installer. And this is all iFile doing its thing in Safari download enabler. And the link I'll put in the description to the download of the dev file. So now it says it's all done, right? You hit done. All right, then it's already installed. So now you can quit out of iFile. And now when you open up uh, Cydia again, you'll be able to see install us five. We'll just let it load. So if you type in I N S T A L IRS install us five has a check mark next to it. Now I recommend that you open up this package and modify and reinstall. I'm not going to do it because there's lots of people downloading, re-downloading this for this next step. I mean, you can use it this way. That's not a problem. It's still going to work. But it's always nice to do a fresh install right from Cydia. But if not, here it is. It's here. So now uh, you have to make sure that you also uh, have AppSync. If this is your first time doing this, uh, AppSync uh, iOS 5.0. Uh, and uh, the reason you need that is to so that iTunes recognizes the apps as your own um, and will kick it out and erase it from your device so anyway uh, that's that so now when we close out um, when you go to your springboard you'll see here install us and that's the install us 5 now if you open that you see that it had a little badge the number 13 um, here's install us 5 it's all set the first thing you want to do is probably hit this and you know let it load up all the categories um, but there's also some other features that you want to enable so to do that you want to close out and go into settings here and it might already be set that way uh, when you first install you want to go into notifications and you want to make sure that install us is inside your notification center and if it, if it's not and if it's something like this where it's down here not notification center you just hit edit and you slide it on up to there then you can hit done and then you can click that and you can have banners or you can have that annoying pop-up uh, you can show the 10 recent make sure notification center is set to on and um, I like to view it in lock screen as well so now it's a notification center so anytime you get a new uh, update to an app that you've downloaded to test um, you'll be able to do that so now if we search something like I don't know uh, I don't know um, I don't know dog a anything you know whatever if you, if there's an app with the name dog it, it will be there so now say you hit this and you hit download now it's slingfile.com and you click that you have to put the caption and all that stuff but also there might be another line there might be another line that has a torrent file so you can click that torrent and it'll download directly. Uh, I, I find that it's it takes longer to download that way, and I like to go the old-fashioned way, but it's all up to you. So there you have it. You have Install Us 5 set uh, onto your device with no error messages like you get when you try to di directly download it from Cydia. Um, you know, just like I said, let's recap. Uh, iFile, Safari Download Enabler, those are the two things you need from Cydia. You need AppSync 5.0 plus you need you know for iTunes and then you have the install us uh, app that you install from Safari using iFile and Safari download manager and then I showed you all the steps and there you go now you have it uh, I recommend before you start using installs you know do a do a, a you know a full shut off and turn back on again okay